This video will show you how to set up your paper and MLA format using Google Docs. From the Docs home screen, open a blank document and then rename it right away so you can find it again easily. Let's start by adding a header with a page number. Navigate to the Insert menu and select Headers and Footers, Header. Then, using the Align and Indent icon, select Write Justify or Write Align. Type in your last name, and then select from the Options menu, Page Numbers. Start at 1 and apply. Make sure you have a space between your name and that first page number. And then make sure that this is also highlighted and then in Times New Roman 12 point font, as that's an MLA standard. Now your pages will automatically increase as you add text. Then you can click anywhere on the blank document to get out of the header. Next, we'll add your name, instructor, course, and date to the top left corner of your document. This is not in Times New Roman 12 point font yet, but don't worry, we're going to fix that soon. Let's also add the title of your paper. You can see that the title is not in the center, so we're going to use our alignment button again to center this on the page. Use title style capitalization, which means that the first, last, and major words of the title will be capitalized. Use lowercase for articles, conjunctions, and prepositions. Before adding the text to your paper, be sure to align it to the left again. So you can do that up here on that left align indentation button. Let's add some content to this document and then adjust the font and the line spacing. The first line of each paragraph should be indented by half an inch. So you can use your tab key in order to do that. Now let's fix the spacing and the font. From the edit menu, choose select all. Then under your text, you're going to select Times New Roman 12 point font. And then using the line and paragraph spacing icon, choose double. And now your document will be double spaced throughout. Our final step is to add a works cited page. Be sure to center the words works cited at the very top of that final page. When you press return, it remains centered. So be sure to use the alignment key to choose left align before adding in your works cited entries. The last step is to make this a hanging indent. There are several ways to do this within um, Google Docs. The way we're going to do it is we're going to select all of our citations. We'll go to the format menu, choose align and indent, indentation options, hanging indent, and 0.5 inches is the correct hanging indent spacing. Once we apply that, you can see that all of our citations have now been formatted accordingly with the hanging indent. And that's how you format a Google Doc with MLA style.